Number two is protein intake. All right, so when we figure out our total amount of calories, the next thing we wanna figure out is what percentage of that do we wanna get from protein, all right? And the general rule of thumb is anywhere between 25 to 30% is what you wanna shoot for. And that's going to help you not only maintain muscle, but if you are strength training, it's also gonna help you build muscle. And remember that building muscle and then maintaining it is one of the most beneficial things that you can do for your resting metabolic rate, which we'll talk about a little bit later. But on the whole, what you wanna focus on is total protein intake after you've focused on total calorie consumed. Now, a typical question I get about protein is, should I eat multiple meals with protein in? Should I have five, six, seven meals with protein all in them? Um, do I have to get protein at certain times, like after my workouts or before my workouts? No. You don't have to worry about any of those detailed specifics. You might find that works better for you in the long run. We'll talk about meal timing a little bit later, but total protein intake for the day is the most important factor. It doesn't, mean, doesn't matter if you get it in the very beginning part of the day or at the very end part of the day or spread out throughout the day. I would say that the most important thing is total protein intake. How you divide that up, like with meal timing, is gonna be up to you and your preference and your schedule and your lifestyle, okay? So don't stress out about that.